so many Pokemon YouTubers have started making and selling their own mystery Pokemon card products. Stemming from the Pokeref mystery packs to the Pokeball Slap City mystery box and even other content creators like Poke Chloe, Roger Ribs, and even Shiny Ver. Mystery card product has been on the rise lately and who's are better to open up than from the people that we know and love to watch open stuff from our favorite hobby. And y'all already know, I had to buy all of them so I could share with you exactly what all this hype is about. And we are gonna start with my personal favorite, the Pokeball Slab City Mystery Box. Pokeball is hands down the most entertaining Pokemon YouTube streamer in the entire community. If y'all wanna laugh, have fun, and be entertained for an hour straight, make sure to go check out his channel. He without a doubt has the best on-screen personality out of any other content creator in this niche. And now it is time to show you exactly what I love so much about this mystery box. I am so freaking unbelievably hyped for this video, y'all. And I'm gonna go ahead and start each mystery product by explaining exactly what it is. As you saw just a second ago, this is from Pokeball. It is a Slab City mystery box. And what will be inside is one graded PSA card of pretty high value. This box was $150 and we are more likely to get the value out of the box than not. It comes with one mystery pack, and that pack is, you know, it's it's a Sword and Shield era pack, and then it comes with some of his merch and some awesome product outside of that. And if you don't know who uh, Pokeball is, y'all, he, my, oh, Scarlet and Violet. I actually didn't know this could be inside of it. That's pretty cool. Uh, and for those of you that don't know Pokeball, he, hands down, is gonna be one of the biggest Pokemon YouTubers in the next year or two. Definitely go check him out and the stars kind of had to align for this video to happen because I was gonna create this video with only four out of the five Pokemon mystery, uh, Pokemon YouTuber mystery items that, that was really offered. And I had no idea Pokevault was coming out with another drop from this set. So it really, did I skip a card? It really just had to fall into place for this. Can we start this out with some first pack magic? That would be a big fat freaking no. And I'm gonna go ahead and get this slap. Wait a minute, this one comes with two packs? What, I did not know that. All right, I will take it, that's pretty cool. The last one did not come with two packs. So this is definitely a little treat, I'm not gonna lie. I did not know this was in here. Maybe we can redeem from that no first pack magic. Come on, y'all. That's the one thing about Japanese cards. I'm shaking, because I'm like getting nervous about what's gonna be in this. There we go, to Dini EX. That is so cool, we got our first hit. Oh my god, I love the texture and I love the Japanese cards because they do not have that dull look like the English Sword and or, uh, Scarlet and Violet set. That is such a beautiful card. I'm glad we're starting this off with a little bit of heat, y'all. And let's go ahead. And honestly, this is such a cool sticker. I give out stickers on my channel for my giveaways. I wish I could find someone that can make them with this reflective material. And then here is some of the additional stuff that comes in here. We have the... Pokeball gym bag, which this is my second one. Definitely using them, I'm not gonna lie. 100% using these. And before we get into this mystery slab, I just wanted to show y'all the effort that this man puts into his into his products. First of all, he signs every one of them, and then look at this design of this box. It is actually a seriously quality material and print. Thank you so much, Pokeball, for putting so much effort into all this. If you're watching, I genuinely appreciate it. Um, Without that, Further ado, let's see what we got in here. All right, I'm gonna try to, ooh, I almost ruined it. Yo, I saw 19.99 on there. I think we got a vintage freaking card. Mm, okay, 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 got it yourself, Justin. A hollow Hitmonchan, and what set is this from? I guess we're about to see, sorry for the glare, y'all. Hitmonchan, hollow, PSA 9, I will take it. That is so freaking awesome, y'all. Oh my God, such a crazy way to start this video. And before we move on, I wanted to show you today's giveaway. We have an absolutely crazy one for such a crazy freaking video. We have an alternate art skunk tank V, a secret rare, a full art, and a bunch of other crazy cards. As long as you are subscribed, like, and comment on this video, everything that you see right here is gonna go to one of y'all. Y'all, next we have the Poke Chloe and Poke Dean mystery pack. She's from Great Britain and like the female equivalent of Poke Rev. She does absolutely insane openings, opening up thousands of dollars with a vintage packs on her channel, ridiculous streams, and always does insane giveaways. I'm so excited to show you exactly what this pack has in it, and now let's rip into it. I have never opened up one of these packs, and the more I'm getting into this opening, the more nervous I'm getting for some reason. I mean, we've already got a base set holo, but what is insane? We can get 
we can get that again because this has a one in 25 chance of a Wizards of the Coast Diamond and Pearl or Platinum Vintage Pack, a one out of 10 black or white or X, uh, XY, and then a Sun and Moon is one out of five, or you have the guaranteed or minimum guaranteed uh, modern sets. And then this also comes with five modern packs. As I mentioned, this is very close to the Pokerev packs. Um, I mean, I, I don't really know what to think. I know she just came out with these packs recently and it's a new thing for her and Pokedean. I'm trying, oh, okay, we already saw it. We got the pink uh, pink pack. We'll open that here in a second. It's okay, we have more chances with the Pokerev and some more opportunities to get something absolutely insane. And then, okay, we're, we're working on it here. Okay, we get two stickers, again, kind of similar to the Pokerev packs. You have the five packs, the two stickers, which like the Pokerev pack comes with his sticker. We have a Pokemon Go, a Celebrations, and this Celebration pack, okay, okay. A Lost Origin, Brilliant Stars, and a Vivid Voltage. Not the craziest packs, but we can still pull some absolutely, absolute bangers from it. Let's go ahead and since this is just a pink pack, rip into it and see what we can get. I'm hoping maybe at least an Evolving Skies with a Moonbreon in it. Is that too much to ask for? I don't really think so. And a Shining Face. We have pulled the Shiny Charizard. Shiny Charizard from Shiny Fates on this channel before. Can we do it again? That's the real question. And for those of you that don't know Poke Chloe, the first time I saw her was honestly about a year ago on um, on Leonhardt's channel. And she is another person that is extremely kind and gives a lot back to the Pokemon community. She does, like I, like I said, some absolutely crazy giveaways on her channel. So, wait a minute. <laughs> hey, hey I, I honestly forgot about these. I'm having a brain fart as to what they're even called right now. But that is an awesome pull. I don't think I've pulled this yet. Oh, gosh, I'm I gotta see what this is called real quick an amazing rare an amazing rare that was I that was painful I'm not gonna lie. Okay, can we get the rainbow Charizard another Charizard that I pulled on this channel and recently got graded I might do a video showing some of those gradings here here soon I've got a few back actually the other day and more about Poke Chloe because that's what this is about Showing all of the different Pokemon youtubers and what they have to offer for everybody. She has about 50,000 to 60,000 subscribers on her moment of truth moment of truth and a muck about 50,000 subscribers on our channel. I definitely like definitely go check her out y'all. She's super fun to watch has some great insane content Constantly doing vintage openings. I don't know where she gets all that money But I mean she spends a lot on Pokemon cards. It's kind of it's kind of scary I, I don't know how she does it. I wish I had that for my channel, but uh, that's a little that's a tier above what I got going on here I'm not gonna lie to you guys uh, Yeah, she I've wait a minute. I think I see something. I think I see something I'm, I'm tired. I'm tired of being lied to. She does openings with Pokedean, which I believe is her husband. I, I think. I'm gonna be honest. I've never really watched Pokedean, so I'm not too sure about what his channel's about. Although, that is exactly it's Pokedean and Poke Chloe packs. So I know they they do them together, but I don't know if that's because they're married or if they're just friends or okay, nothing. Do I? I've. I never, ever, ever get anything good out of celebrations. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what their partnership is, whether it's they're a couple or they just work together with their channels. Really have no idea. And um, y'all gotta let me know down in the comments. What do y'all think about mystery packs? What do y'all think about mystery products? I know a lot of people frown against them, but that's one reason I wanted to do this video. A, because these are super fun to open and you have some chance to... In our first... I mean, I guess th th this is a half hit. I, I don't know if I call that a real hit. We're still waiting on our first hit, y'all. We, we need some we need something absolutely crazy. Will Shining Fates come through with us? For us. I, I really don't know here. Fingers crossed. Yeah, I what do y'all think about mystery packs? That like I said, that's one reason I wanted to showcase these because Pokemon YouTubers often I trust every one of the people that I'm showing here right now to to purchase their mystery product that they're honest on what they're putting in here. They, I mean, we all love these people, so I hope, I hope y'all can trust them as well, because there's a lot of bad mystery product out there. I think the shiny would have been in the uh, reverse spot, so I don't believe we have anything, and we cannot believe we just struck out so hard right there. It's okay. Everything's okay. And next, we're going to open up the Roger Rips Mystery Pack. And Roger Rips is mostly known for his short form content, but probably best known for his famous line. Let's make some money. And when I first started this channel, I took a ton of inspiration from his short form content. He is extremely entertaining. Make sure you go check out his channel. And I am so unbelievably excited to open this up and see exactly what's inside. Will Roger Rips finally come through for us? 
And what his is, he, he comes with, I believe, also five. How the heck do you open this thing? All right, Roger. You're really making this hard to get into. I think he comes with five modern packs as well. And then his is a mystery card. So we'll go ahead and reveal the mystery card last. That's pretty cool. I like that a lot. See, those are those are his socials. Don't, definitely go check him out. This guy is amazing. He has a big following on TikTok and I think Instagram as well. Um, I think his TikTok following is actually bigger than his YouTube following. Asteroid is Silver Tempest, Silver Tempest. Oh, we get six packs in here. Wow. This was only like, I think this was $50 for all this. So that's actually a pretty good deal. Like I said with Poke Chloe, I wholeheartedly trust everybody, every Pokemon YouTuber that I'm showing here that they're going to give you an honest product. And this kind of shows it right here. You just get six packs and then a mystery card for $50. Uh, I guess we'll see here in a second though where the mystery card is. I believe it can be, it's just like an ultra rare above guarantee for all of them. Now, for those of you that don't know Roger Rips, I actually just watched a, um, wait a minute, I think I see something. Am I gonna get lied to again? A Radiant Heatran. That is such a beautiful card as well. I hate how the Radiant cards are so undervalued and that'd be a, a nothing. I, yeah, with him and, uh, with him and Seismic Shock and he is such a down to earth, cool, kind, genuine dude. I, I honestly didn't know what to expect from him. He, I, I mean, I love his content. I, I've taken a lot of inspiration from him, but I didn't expect him to be such just a genuinely awesome guy. And I think that's one thing that a lot of these big name Pokemon YouTubers have in common is, ooh, okay, this is something. And another V card. I'm about to fight these packs here. We need, we need a banger. We need a banger. Man, that's, I feel like that's something that all of these, this is Silver Tempest, by the way, y'all. Oh, we saw the code card. We got to hit in this one. We got to hit in this one. Is this going to finally be our first freaking banger? Besides, well, okay. I'm, I'm sleeping on the Poke Vault uh, Mystery Slab over there. That 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 is probably going to be the best poll this video. It's like a $100 poll. Although, this might be the freaking chance right here. Come on, y'all. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Another B card. Everything's okay. I'm okay. Everything's okay. I say this like every video. I am a talker and it's so hard to get conversations out when I open Pokemon cards because I get so overly excited. It's kind of dumb. Any, anywho, what I've been trying to say for the past five minutes is that's something that all these Pokemon YouTubers have in common. And don't forget about the card, y'all. We're going to reveal this here in a second. Is they're all genuine. They see, oh my God, there's a hit back here again. See what I'm talking about? I can't freaking, I can't, I can't talk. Roger Rips, I don't know if you weighed these, man, but you are coming through so strong right now. You know, all these YouTubers seem to be genuine, kind, honest, and I mean, they all have good personalities, but I feel like that really comes through for them. And that's one reason I love, there we go. I think we got a double banger here. Another V card. You're coming through Roger Rips, but I'm gonna need you to come through with a little bit more heat than that. We still got this guy and maybe that's, maybe that's where it comes in for us. I think we're about to find out here. Oh my God, we got something else in this pack. Jesus Christ, Roger. What, what are you? I, you, I don't even, I literally lost for words. We're about to have, what are we gonna get? Six for six hits here? This is absolutely ridiculous. And this is brilliant star. So this can be something absolutely, absolutely. You didn't see that. You, you didn't see that. Can we get some last pack magic for Roger Rips? Come on, man. I believe, I believe we got something crazy here. So we look at the code card. No, 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 no. Let's not ruin it for ourselves. I almost just ruined it by putting five cards to the front, though. I think, okay, I know I'm, hold on. We definitely, oh my god, that could be the Charizard, y'all. That's a V-Star, I think that's a rainbow V-Star. We about to get the Charizard. Roger Rips, don't play with my heart right now. Oh my god, and we still got a Charizard. Let's go, baby. No freaking way. I do not open up enough Brilliant Stars. Let's just leave this puppy up. It's Brilliant Stars on this channel. But I, every time I do, I pull a Charizard. I... Oh, thank you, Brilliant Stars. Thank you, Roger Rips. I told y'all, Roger Rips came through, man. He's, mm. and I almost forgot about this. We still got this, y'all. We still got this. What's gonna, what is it gonna be? What is it gonna be? A Sydney Folar. I have no idea the price on this card or the set, but hey, I will take that. And I don't know if multiple cards are in here. But I, th I think it's just one, but I'm going to go ahead and check because I'm not really sure. Okay, yeah, it is just one card. And hey, that is a banger. I do got to say, though, that is extremely off-centered, but I'm going to put it in my sleeve. And um, I can't complain. We absolutely hit fire with Roger Rips. Thank you so much, Roger Rips, for offering an absolutely banger product. Like I said, all these products I absolutely love. And um, so far, you're number one. I'm going to be honest. I'm just kidding. Um, 
I, st I, st I still love the Hitman Champ. Sorry, Pokeball. And next we have these Shiny Vert Mystery Packs. These are a little different than the rest of them, y'all. And Shiny Vert has 161,000 subscribers and is probably one of the biggest short form Pokemon content creators on YouTube. He is extremely fun and has some really creative videos. Definitely go check out his channel and let's rip into this because I cannot wait any longer. I've seen a lot of these Shiny Vert product open by Shiny Vert himself. And I, I have to say there are different types of packs and I believe I bought the VMAX God Pack and the um, Ultra Rare God Pack or something like that. Although they're not, they are not labeled, so I really have no idea which one's which. I guess we're, I guess we're about to find out. And technically, they could both come with similar cards because the VMAX God Pack is v all meet VMAX is above. Whether that's a VMAX Rainbow Rare, a VMAX Alternate Art. And same with the Ultra Rare. It can te technically come with any Ultra Rare, so I really don't know what to expect. And this product is very much different than the rest of the products here because they're not actual packs. They're custom. <laughs> oh my god, dude. I did not expect that. I'm assuming this is the Blaziken or the uh, VMAX pack. I absolutely love these three cards right here, except for maybe the Greedon, the Chunky Squirrel, I guess, you know, but it's okay. It's okay. And I wonder if... Because this one was sleeved up better. I wonder if this means that these are going to have the better hits. I don't really know. I don't know much about the, the Shiny Vert packs. Hey, is that a... Okay, Scizor VMAX. That's an absolute banger, but... No, okay, so these are both Glarian Gallery cards, I think. And then this right here is just a regular VMAX. Those are still some absolutely crazy cards to get. You know, I think this was a $25 pack. And in my opinion, that's honestly... It's pretty worth it. I think that'll be worth it. You gotta let me know down in the comments below if you think $25 is worth all of these five different VMAXs right here. And I'm going to assume that this is the Ultra Rare Packs, which um, was also $25. And I don't really know what to expect in these either. Hey, okay, that is, okay, I gotta admit that that uh, Trainer Gallery is not too crazy, but a Magnezone V-Star, oh. that's pretty cool. I'll take that. And a Keldeo EX from Obviously the EX era. I don't know exactly what set that from that's from but that's actually pretty cool I will take it and what I'm liking right now is I'm not seeing any black star promos a lot of the other uh, Mystery pack items like the pokey collect mystery packs that do stuff like this if you don't know I've done several of those openings on my channel They're a very big mystery box company and they Constantly give you black star promos in their mystery card product that are basically exactly like this Can we, ooh, I think I see something crazy here and a Como OGX is that a that is, is that a shiny? I don't know if that's a shiny. That might be a Hidden Fate shiny. I'm not entirely sure. That is such a freaking crazy looking card though. I honestly don't even know too much about that Pokemon. And a Berserker V <laughs> Full Art. I, you know what? I'll take these. That one might be, okay, that's not a Black Star promo, but for $25 as well, what do y'all think? Do y'all think this was worth it? I think this one is probably just as good as the other one, honestly. And thank you Shiny Vert as well for coming through with an absolutely crazy product. Um. I guess we saved the most popular for last. Let's get into this Pokerev mystery pack. And last but not least, we have the Pokerev 3.0 mystery pack. I already know all of you know who this man is. He recently hit 2 million subscribers on YouTube, and many of y'all call him the Mr. Beast of Pokemon card content creation. These packs are incredibly popular and sell out incredibly fast. So I'm so excited that I got to get my hands on one for this video. And with that being said, I cannot wait any longer. Let's rip into this thing, y'all. I don't think Pokerev needs much of an introduction because he sells so many of these mystery packs and they sell out so unbelievably fast. But we're gonna go ahead and it comes with, just like Poke Chloe's five modern mystery packs, and then it has different tiers, right? So it has the green tier, which is a guaranteed modern pack. But what's nice is you can get Evolving Skies out of it and like Crown Zenith and stuff, which are pretty, already pretty expensive packs. Then you have the red tier, one out of five, X and Moon, uh, or uh, sorry, X and Y, or the Sun and Moon era. Then the silver is one out of 10, black and white era. And the gold is a one out of 25, which is vintage packs, Wizards to the Coast, Black and white, or not black and white, uh, platinum and some other the uh, other older eras. Now let's try to open this up without seeing the pack this time, so maybe we can actually get surprised. I have opened up uh, several poker packs on this channel before. Okay, 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 keep that secret. Like I said, very similar to the Poka, uh, Poka Chloe also comes with a poker ref sticker. Yeah, I have po opened these on the uh, opened these on the channel before, and I did get one of the golden packs. Um, and it was a Wizard of the Coast jungle. I got a Wizard of the Coast 1999 jungle pack. Might have been 2000. I don't know the, the year of it. 
And then I actually pulled a holo from that pack too. So for those of you that are skeptical of poker of packs, they are not weighed. And you definitely can get golden uh, the Wizards of the Coast packs in here. These are legit and absolutely insane. Can we start poker of pack off with some crazy first pack magic? I've had unbelievable absolutely insane lucks with luck with poker of packs in the, in the in the past and um hopefully that carries over today for y'all because we need to end this video off with some absolute fire we've got some crazy pulls from so far but some of the packs have not been the hottest except for that charizard i gotta say though you see that lineup back there told y'all this video would be absolutely freaking insane can we get something in chilling rain i've been looking for this altar blaze again for freaking feels like ages well, still going to be looking for it after today. God, Pokerev is absolutely insane, y'all. I have so much respect for this man. He put so much time, effort, and dedication into his channel and into these Pokerev packs. It's absolutely ridiculous. He's doing exactly what I want to be doing. He is chasing the dream to open up Pokemon cards full-time, which I guess he's not chasing the dream. He's already doing that, but I am also chasing that dream is what I'm trying to say. Okay, nothing crazy on that one. Can we finally get something out of Vivid Voltage that... Fat Chonkachu. Yeah, I mean, it, he is is a role model for a lot of us Pokemon YouTubers out here. Uh, showing us that it is possible. The fact that he just hit 2 million subscribers is, is dumb. It's absolutely ridiculous for a Pokemon YouTuber to get 2 million subscribers. That shows how loved he is. Okay, I definitely see something back here. And another V card. All right, y'all. We got one last chance for an just absolutely insane card out of just a regular pack. I can't complain though. This video has been absolutely insane so far. And if we can get a alternate art Lugia out of here, I will. I mean, I, don't, I would. I would lose it. I would absolutely lose it. Moment of silence here, y'all. Another skunk tank V. Well, let's bring it through right here. Let's bring it through right here. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. A red. Hey, I will take it as long as at least it's not a green. I will take a red pack. This can be an X and Y or Sun and Moon, which are still some pretty valuable cards. Uh, I don't think I mentioned it. These packs are also $50. So when you get five packs, which let's estimate $4 a pack, $20 plus an X and Y. Most of the X and Y or Sun and Moon are $15 to $25 a piece. So you pretty much automatically make your money back, plus the experience of just having fun with it. A Cosmic Eclipse pack. Okay, I will take it. There is some fun, there's some absolutely insane cards in here. Maybe we were saving all of our luck up for this. I don't quite remember the card trick. I think it's three or four, but we're gonna go ahead and do three just to be safe here. I am not entirely sure. All right, let's slow roll this, guys. Come on. Pokerev, let's let's come through with us today. Come through for us today. Y'all gotta let me know in the comments. And I think it's three. Y'all gotta let me know in the comments which mystery pack y'all thought was best and most worth it. All right. I think a lot of y'all and an Ursa Ring. Nothing crazy out of the Pokerev packs today, but I think a lot of y'all are gonna share with me the best one is the Poke Vault. I absolutely love his product. But Pokerev, yours are absolutely insane too. Thank you so much as well for putting all the effort that you put into these. They're all so much fun. Again, I trust every one of these that I showed y'all today. I hope y'all had as much fun as I did as well. Look at all of the absolute fire that we got in today's opening. And if y'all wanted to watch more content, make sure you click the video below. Do not forget like, comment, subscribe to win that giveaway. And I will see y'all in the next one.